going to join us on our Disney date. Yeah. <laughs> Yesterday on Instagram we decided that we were going to let you guys decide what we were going to do today. I don't know if that was a good thing or a bad thing. <laughs> we both got our preferences I think haven't we over certain yeah. things. I haven't checked it for a little bit actually so we'll have to sort of see where we're up to. Just a shout out to Jade Billington. She's got a YouTube channel and this is kind of where we got the idea from to do this. We've done it differently to them um, but uh, yeah so shout out to you. Thank you so much for the idea. I'm interested to see what the results are because yeah. like, like you said we've not, we've not looked at them for, for a while. We had a quick sneaky look before like bed last night. I think we kind of could see which way it was going, so yeah. it might not be too much of a surprise to us. Unless it's, yeah, unless it's drastically changed. Like overnight. Yeah. We're going to check the results now for the first poll, which was what we should wear. Come on, Spirit Jersey. No! Ah! Oh! So, Spirit Jersey is 57% and Dapper Day is 43%. Dapper day. I feel like I still want to kind of try and I'm gonna try and maybe dress it up a little bit because a dapper spirit jersey. Yeah. No, I don't mean to that degree, but I don't know. I feel like because it's a date night. I feel like I wanted to. No, it's a casual dining date night now. Okay. Right then. So spirit jerseys. Now we just need to decide what spirit jersey. Yeah. No, I just think he's actually gonna try and find our spirit jerseys. Yeah. Oh no, I know where mine are. No. I know where one of mine is, but I think all the others are in. That Disney box, which is in the back of the wardrobe. <laughs> we have a Disney, um, a Disney box for clothes, like for, for parks and stuff. Each we do have one, but we haven't used some of it for a while because obviously we're not been able to go to the park. However, after lockdown's finished, we're we're gonna try and go as much as possible. <laughs> <laughs> That's the plan, everyone. I'm sure you guys are all the same. We just want to just go as soon as as soon as we can and as much as we can. So, um, definitely got Disney withdrawals yeah. here in this household <laughs> at the moment. But um, yeah, should we go and get ready then? Yes. Okay. So these are our spirit jerseys. You can tell which ones are gems. They're all colourful. <laughs> and mine are all black dark. and blue. <laughs> I've also got a black one. Um, yeah, a black Disneyland Paris one. Yeah, just like Anthony's, but I, I don't know what I'm doing with it. Do you know which one you're going for? I think I'm going to go for that one. The Disneyland Paris one? I think so. <gasps> Is that bad because I do know what Disney World is? You're going to wear Disneyland Paris in well, Disney World? Well, I've only got my rose gold one. Oh uh, yeah, it's up to you. As I was saying, that when we went to Disney Disneyland Paris, I wore this Walt Disney World one. Yeah. No, I don't think it matters, does it? I'm going to wear my colourful one. I think I'm going to wear this one. This is my favourite one. Ah, it's nice, that one, actually. It's from the All-American range. I love that All-American range. Every time we go, I'm always like, oh, I just want to buy so much stuff from that <laughs> range. So that one and that one. Yeah, we're kind of opposites as well, like with the blues. Yeah. <laughs> I'm ready. <laughs> Oh, you've changed your hair, I see. Yeah, I thought I'd make a bit of an effort. I was, I was kind of hoping for Dapper Day, so I thought if I kind of do my hair, then it makes me feel a bit better that I'm not, we're not, we didn't, people didn't vote for Dapper Day. So thank you to those people that did vote Dapper Day. Though, <laughs> so, and you're happy that everyone voted for a jersey. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'm pleased with my outfit. I wasn't sure whether to wear jeans or not. No, not a Walt Disney World. Yeah, it's more of Disneyland Paris, yeah. isn't it? But, um, Even though yeah. we are in the UK in January. I know. We probably should have gone for cropped leggings, actually. But that's okay. Yeah, that's well. okay. Yeah, Does that see the back? Disneyland Paris. <laughs> and here's Anthony. <laughs> Anthony's actually done, like, the full... <laughs> He's posing. <laughs> um, yeah, you're wearing shorts. Yeah, it's hot in Florida. It's Aww. Like, sleeves up. <laughs> And you've got your magic band on too. Yeah. Uh, Just in case I need to pay for anything. Yeah. <laughs> Quick service. <laughs> <laughs> you put yours on with that. Yeah, it. I've got the red one on. I don't know if you can see it there. I've got the red one on. Um, all right. So should we check our next? <gasps> oh, very nice. It's such a nice spirit jersey, that, isn't it? Very nice, very I'm, smart. I'm going to roll the sleeves up on a spirit jersey. I, I do. do. Oh, do you? Yeah. I don't, but... <laughs> so shall we check our next our next um yes. vote now it was oh, ears yeah, wasn't yes. it yeah okay let's do it it was between the green the minty green and pink pair which are these are official Walt Disney World ones and then these beautiful Rapunzel um 
Tangled Ears, which are um, from Handmade by Linz. So go and check her shop out because she's amazing. Um, I have lots of different pairs of ears from Handmade by Linz and they're all pretty, pretty. <laughs> so um, yeah, so go on then, tell us the results, which ones. Are you ready? Yeah. Do you have a preference? Um, you kind of chose them both originally, didn't you? I so chose you, them both. both I think I like these because they're a little bit more... Um, there's just more detail on them. Yeah. But I, I love the colour of these ones, so I don't mind. But I think I slightly prefer the more of these ones. Are you ready? Yeah. Da, 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 da. <laughs> purple wins. Hooray! It was quite close, actually. It was, was uh, it? purple one by 56%. Oh, gosh. And what was it? 40... 44. Right, okay. No, very close. Yes. Mm. I'm happy with this choice, though. Okay. So. Put them on, put them on. Yeah? Yep. Okay. Hey. Good to go. So what's next? <laughs> what is next? Is it, is is it, it the food? eat one? Yeah, it's the way we should eat, isn't it? Okay. Should we go down to the kitchen then? Yeah. The next oh. question that we asked was where should we eat? Mm -hmm. and the two choices were either garden grill or sci-fi dining. This was quite a, uh, quite a big difference. Go on. So the winner is sci-fi dining with 66%. See, I'm I'm quite I'm quite happy about that because yeah. we've not had any takeaways or anything and it, and it'll be nice to kind of have like a burger even though we're going to make like healthy burgers we decided what we're going to do it depending on which way it went it would be I'm quite looking forward to it. I'm not eating it in the car though. <laughs> Do you know what? I did think about that. We didn't talk about it, but no, I thought no. the same thing. We should have eaten it in the car. Well, I Can guess... you imagine how, how, what our neighbours think? Yeah, no. If we had a drive, then I might be tempted, but it, the car's just in the, on, on the street outside. I don't really fancy <laughs> taking a burger outside just to eat it and the neighbours would be like... What are they doing? <laughs> if we were Garden Grill, we're going to do like a... Um, like a family style. Like a family, like. Yeah, like a family style with like turkey. It would have been after having like a... Um, a vegetarian, a vegetarian yeah. yeah meat but um we're gonna do family style but with a sci-fi dining we're going to do burger and fries we'll get our disney refillable mugs out. yeah that's nice um I'm, I'm sure we've got some fizzy drink in the fridge somewhere that we can that we can use and that's over from christmas because we're not we're trying to be good aren't we yes i'm thinking we could probably get like my ipad or the laptop and try and play some old 50s type Sci-fi movie movies on while we, while yeah, we eat. That'd so that'd be really nice. Are we going to sit at the table? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Maybe we should sit next to each other like we're in a car. Yeah, I think we'll do that. <laughs> I did love it when we went. I did absolutely love it in there. Yeah, it was really it was cool, wasn't it? Yeah. It was a bit dark. We were saying we were trying to look for photos and stuff, and we were like, we haven't got any. We didn't take any because it's too dark in there. I'm so excited for the burgers. And we're really hungry because we haven't eaten anything all day, just so we could eat. This yeah, we could just enjoy food, ourselves yeah. tonight. So yeah, should we should we get with the food? Sure. Let's do it. Just looking at the menu for sci-fi dining and we've decided that we're going to do the classic American burger, which is the the beef burger, but we're going to use corn um, on a brioche bun, caramelised onions, American cheese, bacon, lettuce and a gourmet tomato. Uh, I'm not going to have bacon on mine, but you're going to have bacon on yours. Mm -hmm. um, so let's see how far we get. $19! $19 this would cost. <laughs> It just goes to show when you don't have the dining plan. <laughs> like, it really makes a difference, doesn't it? Yeah. Gosh, $19. Here's all our ingredients for our burgers. So we've got these Plant Chef meat-free burgers from Tesco's. Um, we've got some salt for seasoning for later on. We've got the red onion chutney. We've got lettuce, brioche buns, bacon for me. Anthony's not having any bacon. Um, reduced fat mild cheddar American cheese <laughs> um, and a big beef tomato so uh, yeah we're gonna we're gonna put them in the oven i think yeah yeah rather than grilling them because the fries need to go in the oven as well don't yeah. they so yeah we're having fries too yeah that aren't displayed here <laughs> okay here's the burgers we're just putting <laughs> <in> now <laughs> they look they look not like normal burgers <laughs> Show the table, yeah. The fries and the onion rings, which we didn't show before, are already in there. Yeah, we did a couple of onion rings each as well, beer battered ones. Yeah. Yes! We did it! Yay! <laughs> How amazing does it look? We never make burgers. Well, especially ones with salad on, anyway. I'm dead excited. Yeah. Need to uh, go into the uh, movie theatre. <gasps> Have you set it up like a movie theatre? Not really. Who needs takeaways, guys? This is great. Right. 
Really? So apologies in advance because it'll go dark, so it might. <gasps> Ooh, this is so good. Uh, is so this the what the is this the what's on in the actual sci-fi dining? Yeah, yeah. So it's like a the reel from it. This is amazing. <laughs> <gasps> yes. So here's a better look at the setup. It was a bit dark before. So we've got a little footstool. Um, as our car, car. Yeah. <laughs> we've got our resort mugs, our burgers, our cushions to sit on, our wife, <laughs> and we've got the movies playing. I'm so excited. Right now, the question before the house is: what? <laughs> It is Disney date night. When do we eat? <laughs> Okay. I'm going to try my burger. I'm going for it. <laughs> All the sci-fi vibes in the background. It tastes like the Cumberland sausages that we have. Oh, the plant-based one. Yeah. yeah. Obviously the same stuff, because it? it's, it's a pea protein, so yeah. it's the same stuff, isn't it? Oh, nice. Mm -hmm. Not mine, yeah. Although well, I am concerned that all that barbecue sauce, but I've not drank barbecue sauce before, have okay. <laughs> <laughs> We finished our burgers. We've left the restaurant. <laughs> Did you like your burger? Yeah, it was good. Good, yeah. I thought so too. It was really tasty. It's good that Walt Disney World are now doing some vegetarian <laughs> Some plant based burgers. <laughs> yeah. Well done, Walt Disney World. <laughs> but we're now going to check what park show you guys have chosen for us to watch. Nighttime Spectacular. Ooh. So I don't have a I can't choose between these two. These are both, they're both my favourite. So you we'll really see. Can't I can't choose. I couldn't choose. I'm, I'm very, very, um, what's the word? Attached to Fantasmic. And we've said this before, but please don't ever change it because it's just such an amazing show. I know you disagree. It, it needs a upgrade. I think. Yeah, but don't take any time off it. Don't do any major changes because it is perfect as it is. I think, yeah, I think I could understand what you mean about it. it. could do with a bit of an upgrade. But it's just the most incredible. And you know what? When I describe it to people, there's just no words to describe how good it is. And I just, I, I, oh, every time I explain it to someone, everyone seems really like underwhelmed. And I'm like, no, 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 you just need to see it as the most incredible show. And then Happily Ever After is also that too like i just think the music's amazing the fireworks just being in front of the castle with all the amazing projections i just love it and it makes me cry every time <laughs> so okay let's see what you've chosen are you ready mm. go on tell me <gasps> go on not telling you oh you've got to tell me go on with 69 percent of the vote oh that's quite high Happily ever after. Uh, okay, that's fine. I would have been totally happy watching either of those. <laughs> so, okay, happily ever after. That's nice. So we better hot put it over to the Magic Kingdom because we're in Hollywood Studios at the minute. Yeah, quick, cover the bus. Let's go. <laughs> We've got our spot in front of the castle. Wow. It's not too crowded today, which no. is good. Yeah. <laughs> Social distance. Exactly. We brought Mickey along with us this time. Right. <laughs> this is the one from the, um, the advert. Oh, the Christmas advert. The Christmas advert. Anthony bought it me as a Christmas present. It's very cute. It's got some really cute little stitches. And the... Uh, yeah, we brought him with us. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, so what, what what's next? We just need to wait for the fireworks to start. Yeah. So we need to go and lower the lights in the Magic Kingdom. <gasps> the lights will be lowered. I don't know if that's what <laughs> I don't know what the phrase is. Lowering the lights. Okay. Yeah, normally everybody everybody ooze at that point, don't they? You feel the hustle and bustle. Yeah, it's like <gasps> everyone's getting excited. It's time, it's time, it's time, it's time. <laughs> okay, you ready? I am ready. You're gonna control your emotions. I'm gonna try. <gasps> I 
And when we're brave enough to listen, don't cry, it's fine. That dream will lead us on a journey. Diamond's not even dying yet. All we have to do is let them wander, take And so our journey comes to an end. But you'll continue. It's the voice. Yeah, I'm cold. You'll miss thinking about you crying. I just think the words are really good. Let your dreams guide you. Reach out and find your Covered. <laughs> to get the boo hoos out. Honestly, and I think because we've not seen it for a while, we used to watch it quite a lot, didn't we? Um, I just it everything that came out then <laughs> is how it's not ever, like obviously not all of how much I love Disney, but it's just that's just how much it means to me. Like I just think it's just brilliant, and it brought back how sad I am. I guess not to have been able to have gone on past trips and stuff but it's like i said before it, it's it's been the right thing to do and um we just need to be safe so it's fine but it does make you sad doesn't it when you does uh, when you watch stuff like that but i do love happily ever after so much uh, i am gonna have to go and redo my makeup i think in a second um didn't really didn't anticipate how sad that was gonna make me i knew i might get a tear but i'm completely, completely overcome with emotion so sorry guys shall we see what our next our next yeah. one is... So it's Disney Snack, the next one. So it was either a choice between Rice Krispie Treat or the ice cream cookie sandwich. Yeah. Okay, let's um, see. No, I actually had a cookie sandwich before. We haven't had one. No, however, do you know what I'm desperate for? And you think I made it Like you were saying like, while I thought ago, you made it up. I thought I'd made it up. The churro ice cream sandwich. With... 57%, so quite close. You've already seen it, haven't you? Yeah, I've seen it, I've seen it. <laughs> We're not telling you. So, <laughs> it's the ice cream cookie sandwich. Yes, 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 yes. I'm excited about this. Yeah. I like um, different textures in food. So I like cold uh, okay. and, and like cold um, and smooth with the like obviously i don't know if we'll make our cookies hot or not but um but the hot and the crumbly and the and the i don't know i just love it i love it alternative texture <laughs> yay i'm so excited thank you guys for that. <laughs> that's that's probably cheered me up now so um okay so i think i'll go and just top my makeup up and then we'll go and make up. that top up yeah. makeup up top my makeup up <laughs> yeah yeah let's go yeah. we've got these sticky toffee cookies which are a bit sort of chunkier and then we've also got these milk chocolate cookies. And then um, just vanilla ice cream. We thought because we've got two different types of cookie that we would do one of these and one of these. So top and bottom and yeah. then and then ice cream in the middle. And we're going to do two scoops. Yeah. We're just going to share one. We're not going to have one each. We're not because we learned from our Home Alone vlog. <laughs> we were monsters that day. So we're just going to have yeah. half each. <laughs> okay. Does it get 
it this way? Yes. Right. Okay. Should we just do it? Well, it's nice and soft though. Oh, it's really soft. Should we, do, should we say that's a scoop or is that more than a scoop? That's more than a scoop, isn't it? Probably. Two scoops. Scoop! Yeah, as long as it just fills the bottom. Hey. Yeah. That's too much, it's isn't it? Spines. You might just have to smush them together. How are we gonna cut this in half? I don't know, look how good that looks. Ah, nom nom nom. Yes. How are we gonna cut it in half? I don't know. A big knife. We need to play with our magic band. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> That's not the noise it makes. <laughs> Pachoo. <Bong, bong. laughs> okay. Oh, all the ice cream's gonna come out. Don't matter. This is the happiest that you know what? Lockdown absolutely sucks. <laughs> this is great. Take a bite with all the layers. Mmm. Mmm. Does the cookie need to be warm? That is amazing. Is it? Mmm. I can't wait to get back to Disney World and <laughs> try one from there now. <laughs> you want to just try one right now? I know, but I mean, this is amazing and it's good. It's just, oh, it's good. What's good about it? I love the texture, so the crunchiness and against the soft ice cream. The ice cream is really, um, it's very vanilla y. Um, you can really taste the, you know, the sticky toffee coming through. Good choice then for that. Really good choice. You I ready? Am, I almost just dropped them both on the floor. We missed filming it. I would not have been happy. Jared passed me the plate, they both just slid. <laughs> And I was like, <laughs> go on, go for it. I just want to smush it all in. Oh, yeah. Go for it. It's going to be the best thing oh, you've ever had. <laughs> <Call it up. laughs> good, isn't it? It is good. Oh, I can't, I'm sensing a butt. I do think it would be better if the cookies were a bit warmer. Oh, why did we should have warmed them? Okay, yeah, you're probably right, it would have been nicer warmer. You are right about the toffee though. Oh, it's good, isn't it? I mean, it's because I think there's salt in it. Mmm. And that's what, that's what really boosts yeah. the flavour. Good. Well done, everyone. Good choice. Good choice. Thank you very much for making our day. <laughs> right, last one. Last, last choice. Movie is, time. Yeah, a Disney film. So the choices were Sleeping Beauty yep, and not. The Princess and the Frog. So do you have a preference? Yes. Do you want to say what it is? Princess and the Frog. Yeah. I love them both. I know I say that for everything. I have like, I feel like Sleeping Beauty was um, a film I used to watch all the time when As I was child, little. Yeah. Mm, but I love Princess and the Frog. I love the music in Princess and the Frog more than anything. I think it's got such a good soundtrack. So, I don't mind. I actually don't mind. And I don't really feel in the mood for... I'm happy for either. Yeah. Should we have a look then? Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Bear with us, Carla. <laughs> okay. Do you want to do some... Do you want to do... Oh, you're... are you there? I'm here. Okay. I, know, I know the results. Okay. I'm not going to look at you too. With 59%. That... Oh my gosh, that's really close. Okay, 59%. The Princess and the Frog. Ah, oh, that's nice. Yes, good choice, people. Good choice. Either choice would have been brilliant, but it's a, I'm looking forward to watching it. What's your favourite song in it? Um, Either Going Down the Bayou. Going, going down, down the Bayou. bayou. Or, um, don't Matter What You Look Like. Love that song. Don't Matter What You Wear. How many rings you got on your fingers? We don't care. No, we don't care. Woo! Should we watch the film? Yes. Okay, let's do it. finished it. 
It was good. It was really good. <laughs> I'd forgotten how good it was, actually. I knew it was good, but um, oh, that bit gets me over time. I was thinking, I was doing so well all the way through, and I was like, oh, like with Ray, you know which bit I'm talking about. And it just gets me every time. It's fine the first part of it, but then, oh, no, not the very end bit. I can't I thought cope. you were doing well. Did you think I was yeah, doing yeah. well? Yeah, no. I, I, I was just like, <laughs> I totally came to the last minute but um yeah such a beautiful beautiful film i hope you've enjoyed coming along with us on our disney date yeah. thank you so much to every single one of you that interacted on instagram and um, we were actually really blown away looking at how many people had yeah, voted yeah. We were so surprised when we looked we're like oh my god look how, how many people have voted i know so thank you so much honestly like it really means a lot if you want to drop us a comment in the comment box below and let us know what you would have done differently or would you have chosen the same things and yeah just uh, just drop us a comment and say hello if you want to if you enjoyed this vlog we'd really appreciate it if you would click on the thumb and give us a thumbs up if you want to follow our future adventures if you click on the subscribe button and also the notification bell then you'll get a little um email to your inbox when we bring a new vlog out we are doing every saturday we are obviously we did have plans for january they're all up in the air at the moment because we're in lockdown but um we don't know what we're going to be doing but we will hopefully bring in a video out every saturday okay. so um yeah so click that that, that subscribe button and uh, you'll you won't miss out <laughs> so thank you so much for watching guys we really do appreciate every single one of you so thank you so much i hope you're all having a good uh first couple of weeks of 2021 and we'll see you next week bye guys bye.